slithered his way in there, kind of lost his balance, but was still able to keep his footing and a nice finish. Nice spin move, George Niang. Put the whooping on Santa Cruz a couple One, weeks ago. 139, 121. Walton with the jumper on the other side. Floater and one for Clee Anthony early tonight. So just because Santa Cruz won by 20 on Friday on the road doesn't mean it's going to be an easy game here. It's George Niang with that easy flowing game. And there were a couple games where you didn't think he was going to shoot it ever because he was just trying to rack up 25 assists. Niang, baby hooks it home. When you're struggling to score, you've got to try to get some easy baskets in transition with some good defense to start it. But Niang, who entered tonight 30 for 61 by Alex Hamilton, cut him off and then was able to force the bad shot. Quinn Cook with the left hand going second side. What a finish off the window. Would have a half game lead over Oklahoma City in the Midwest Division. Damian Jones, 18-footer, rattles it down. Initiates the contact and puts it in high off the glass. Pretty much touched every part of the rim. McCree stripped. Craig almost stripped. Throws it between the legs of Mitchell, taken away. Niang to Cook to Early and the bucket. First, 115-98. Phil Pressey, 21, 15, and 17 in that game. Floater good for George Niang. It's it back for Holmes for three. And Sutherland, the offensive rebound. Another look at a three. This time Niang, Gucci.